They were here for you. Here. I gotta make a stop at ammunition. You're meeting me at the Lost MC's airfield. I'll come in your ear when I get a hold of you. Oh, why are you buying at the gun shop? I'm not buying anything. I need a sniper rifle with a high-power scope. Melvin, how you feel about brand synergy, huh? That sniper on your wall looks like it'll do the job. That's the chestnut. All right, now stop selling weapons to that half-wit Cletus. Meet me at the water tower just north of the airfield. Roger that, Trevor. But you gotta look out, because there's bikers all over this airstrip. Of course there are! Two planes are touching down at the field on a weapons run. We're gonna wait till the right time and appropriate them. We are? I'm up here. I don't see the hardware, but I do see a hell of a lot of bikers. Hardware's not here yet. I'm coming up. Up here! The time is right. Go on, my son. Whenever you get a doubt in your mind, I want you to remember that I'm watching you through the scope of a high-powered rifle. Right, Trevor. Right, right. Got it. Now, relax. The ATV can only take you so far. Park it and don't let them spot you. Can you see me, Trevor? Here, by the road. You wouldn't believe this, Ron. One of these assholes is having a seizure or something. That's me! That's me! Don't shoot! I saw a guy by the tower. I shot him. Now keep moving. Hurry it up, Ronnie! the light so you can calm down. Good. Well, uh, don't shoot the guy in the van until he stops and gets out, okay? Sailor. Get your sights back on me, Trev. I'm scared. Let's pick up the pace, Ron. You're in my crosshairs again. And there's no one left to kill, so get over to that gas tank and plant the bomb. I can't. There's someone coming out of that building. I can hear him at that far door. There's another guy coming out of the building. Good kill, Trevor. Sneak up on me, okay? And whatever you do, don't hit the tank. Please, man. I think someone's coming. Shit. He sees me! He sees me, Trevor! This is it! He clocked me! A bolt from the blue! Can you hear that? Chopper! Incoming! Always hated that chopper! Just fucking drive! You're bikers! <laughs>
crates, Trevor! Just like you said! The rest of the guns must be on the plane down the end of the runway. Vamos! Go! Let's go, Ronald! some lost MC business in the armaments and narcotics sectors for some time. And that kind of requires someone to purchase our guns. Right, of course. But Johnny K and the figurine? Recent events, my impending departure included, have only expedited things. Trevor Phillips Enterprises is a far superior organization to the Lost Leather Club. Well, we hope we improve revenue streams, cut overheads, and maximize profit, all that. <laughs> I wouldn't expect anything less. For one thing, we won't be paying a bunch of idiots to stand around in cowhide sniff engine fumes. It's important work you're doing out here. God knows, we need a sharp mind running things. I am blessed to be a part of it. Better be. Drop your load. Fort San Kuro coming up. If we fly low, we ain't gonna show up on military radar. Successfully delivered, Ron. Now remember, if you beat me to the airstrip, I'll butcher your carcass and wrap you in cheesecloth. We're gonna make some coin from that hardware, boss. TP Enterprises are raising guidance, and the Lost MC are posting unexpectedly soft projections for the coming quarter. They're getting everything that's coming to them. A vast criminal conspiracy like the Lost MC shouldn't let a goon like Johnny K represent them. He was a man past his prime. I heard he used to be serious. A few hard stamps to the head knocked the seriousness right out of him. Sure did. But before that, I mean, back in Alderney. Man was weak for Crystal, weak for Ashley. Man was weak. Shouldn't have spoken to me like that. He shouldn't have. He was a fool. And you corrected him. He'll not do that again. Blow over the swamp, boss. So the guns are going to Mexico? Mexico, yeah. Guy in the boat is Oscar Guzman. He's in with the cartels. If there's a market, this could be a way to expand the business. Like I hadn't thought of that? We might be able to buy into Oscar's thing, but leave that to me, Ron. I'm sorry to ask this, but does your contact pay well for this kind of shipment? 
because I've got those lawyer fees for the divorce and my settlement costs. Oh, he pays. Better than any in this sorry country. That's good to hear, man. We'll talk about the exact split when we're grounded, okay? Hey, bud. What you... I got just a thing. Let's raise some hell, neighbor. Oh, I'm in. I'll introduce you to one of my all-time favorite pastimes. <laughs> You're gonna love this. Okay. You see them three big satellite dishes? A decent shot, and they'll go down easier than a whore's drawers. You're a real pillar of the community. Half the folks in this town would sell their own mother, and most of the other half already did. Screw them. <laughs> no more reality TV for you, Mrs. Gilbert. Okay, one more for the road. Yeah, that's it. Give them hell. Shoot another one. Boom! <laughs> Didn't I tell you this would be more fun than a barrel full of pussies? Ooh, you're a classy day, Cletus. No denying that. <laughs> now drive us up to that abandoned motel. I got an even better idea. Ain't she your beauty? Drives like a dream. So, what now? We gonna try our luck on something less stationary. Ooh, liberals? Nothing as slippery as that, you'll see. You've got way too much time on your hands. Nah, this is just a bit of foolery. I've been busier than hell with the real hunting. The money and wild organic meat these days, you wouldn't believe. Them hipsters will give you their parents' last dime for it. Careful, I ain't got insurance. Here we are. I bet you never shut out the tires on a car before? Oh, you'd be surprised. Well, let's see what you got then. Ain't you gonna shoot anything, Cletus? Nah, I do this all the time, and I wanna see how you deal with a moving target. This is perfect, right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good, plain, old-fashioned fun. I'm pro-gun control. A steady hand on the trigger. Nice! Go on, one more, just for the hell of it. Hellfire, Trevor, you ain't rushing this, are you? Come on, 
Gotta show them sometimes you ain't a slave to the system. That's it, beauty! And again, Trevor. That was some damn fine shooting, Trevor. Right, let's change it up. Come on, follow me. Just two fellers killing time in small town America. Don't get much better than this, does it? The two most popular guys in town. Am I glad I ran into you? Ain't nowhere near this fun being antisocial on your own. Whatever cranks your tractor, I say. What's up next on the hillbilly anarchist agenda? Ever shot anything with a face? Actually, let me ask it again. Ever shot anything with a face on four legs? Now, Cletus, it's important you realize I'm a man plagued by vicious rumors. Fine. Let's head for the roof. I seen some coyotes hanging around down by the road. Reckon it would be real neighborly of us to get rid of a couple. And we are nothing if not neighborly. Easy there, Twinkle Toes. We'll get a better shot from up here. Him. Looks like we got two packs of coyotes down there. Take a few of them out and the rest should scatter. <laughs> two for one! You're even saving on bullets now. Hellfire! That should do it. Nicely done. I reckon you should tag along next time I go hunting out at Polito Bay. I'll don't aim at something you ain't prepared to kill. Hey, bud, what you do? I got just a thing. Let's raise some hell, neighbor. Oh, I'm in. I'll introduce you to one of my all-time favorite pastimes. <laughs> You're gonna love this. Hellfire! Boom! <laughs> Didn't I tell you this would be more fun than a barrel full of pussies? Ooh, you're a classy date, Cletus. No denying that. <laughs> now drive us up to that abandoned motel. I got an even better idea. Ain't she a beauty? Drives like a dream. So, what now? We're gonna try our luck on something less stationary. Ooh, liberals? Nothing as slippery as that. You'll see. You've got way too much time on your hands. Nah, this is just a bit of foolery. I've been busier than hell with the real hunting. The money and wild organic meat these days, you wouldn't believe. Them hipsters will give you their parents' last dime for it. It's gotten so I can't even keep up with the demand no more. All this eat local, small batch, farm to table bullshit. You know, I could maybe use another pair of hands if I can get you up to snuff with that rifle. Here we are. I bet you never shut out the tires on a car before? Oh, you'd be surprised. Well, let's see what Dog. you got. got no then, ain't you gonna shoot anything, Cletus? Nah, I do this all the time, and I wanna see how you deal with a moving target. This is perfect right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good, plain, old-fashioned fun.
When in doubt, take him out. Hellfire, Trevor, you ain't rushing this, are you? Cars don't burst. Shoot the tires. <gasps> You'll do a lot better with a sniper rifle. Ain't you gonna use the rifle I gave you? That ain't the weapon for this. Believe me. You're slower than molasses on a cold day. Go on, one more, just for the hell of it. Pop the tires is much more fun. That's it, beauty. And again, Trevor. That ain't right. I never knew you were such an agitator, Cletus. All these damn tourists coming out here to gop at rednecks. Give them what they want, I say. Man, not too bad, Trevor. Right, let's change it up. Come on, follow me. Just two fellers killing time in small town America. Don't get much better than this, does it? The two most popular guys in town. Am I glad I ran into you? Ain't nowhere near this fun being antisocial on your own. Whatever cranks your tractor, I say. What's up next on the hillbilly anarchist agenda? Now, Cletus, it's important you realize I'm a man plagued by vicious rumors. We'll get a better shot from up here. I ain't in no mood for no punch-up right now. Maybe later. Him. Looks like we got two packs of coyotes down there. Take a few of them out and the rest should scatter. <laughs> Sing to me now, song dog, and another. Them varmints are always getting at the trash and chicken. Worst thing about the Alamo Sea, coyotes. I don't know. I can think of a couple more things. Don't be going soft on them critters now. Hey, where are you going? Have we got coyotes down there and a chicken up here? What are you doing? Did I say something? <laughs> Nobody can accuse us of being Hellraisers now, can they? Servants of the community, Cletus. a bad habit. I think you got one more in you, Trevor. Hellfire! That should do it. Nicely done. I reckon you should tag along next time I go hunting out at Polito Bay. I'll show you how to bag an elk. Ah, why not? All right, gotta go. I'll send you a text when I'm about.
Hey, bud. What you do? I got just a thing. I got just a thing. Let's raise some hell, neighbor. Oh, I'm in. I'll introduce you to one of my all-time favorite pastimes. You're gonna love this. Boom! <laughs> Didn't I tell you this would be more fun than a barrel full of pussies? Ooh, you're a classy day, Cletus. No denying that. <laughs> now drive us up to that abandoned motel. I got an even better idea. Ain't she your beauty? Drives like a dream. So, what now? We're gonna try our luck on something less stationary. If you wreck my buggy, Trevor, you've got way too much time on your hands. Nah, this is just a bit of foolery. I've been busier than hell with the real hunting. The money and wild organic meat these days, you wouldn't believe. Them hipsters will give you their parents' last dime for it. Here we are. I bet you never shut out the tires on a car before. Oh, you'd be surprised. Well, let's see what you got then. Ain't you gonna shoot anything, Cletus? Nah, I do this all the time, and I want to see how you deal with a moving target. This is perfect right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good, plain, old-fashioned fun. Fire, Trevor, you ain't rushing this, are you? You're slower than molasses on a cold day. Gotta show them sometimes you ain't a slave to the system. That's it, beauty. And again, Trevor. When in doubt, take him out. What? Nice. Go on, one more, just for the hell of it. That was some damn fine shooting, Trevor. Right, let's change it up. Come on, follow me. Huh? Holy shit! Just two fellers killing time in small town America. Don't get much better than this, does it? The two most popular guys in town. Am I glad I ran into you? More chance of landing a cargo plane. I have three speeds. On, off, and don't push your luck. Get a better shot from up here. All right, I see him. Looks like we got two packs of coyotes down there. Take a few of them out, and the rest should scatter. Sing to me now, song dog, and another.
them varmints are always getting at the trash and chicken. Worst thing about the Alamo Sea, coyotes. I don't know. I can think of a couple more things. Hellfire! That should do it. Nicely done. I reckon you should tag along next time I go hunting out at Polito Bay. I'll show you how to bag an elk. Ah, why not? All right, gotta go. I'll send you a text when I'm about. Don't get your panties in a wall now. Hey, bud, what you do? I got just a thing. Let's raise some hell, neighbor. Oh, I'm in. I'll introduce you to one of my all-time favorite pastimes. <laughs> You're gonna love this. Okay, you see them three big satellite dishes? Yeah, that's it. Give them hell. Shoot. Boom! <laughs> Didn't I tell you this would be more fun than a barrel full of pussies? Ooh, you're a classy day, Cletus. No denying that. <laughs> now drive us up to that abandoned motel. I got an even better idea. Ain't she a beauty? Drives like a dream. So, what now? We are gonna try our luck on something less stationary. Ooh, liberals? Nothing as slippery as that. You'll see. You've got way too much time on your hands. Nah, this is just a bit of foolery. I've been busier than hell with the real hunting. The money and wild organic meat these days, you wouldn't believe. Yeah, go easy, owner. What are you doing to my vehicle? If you wreck my buggy, Trevor. Here we are. I bet you never shut out the tires on a car before? Oh, you'd be surprised. Well, let's see what you got then. Ain't you gonna shoot anything, Cletus? Nah, I do this all the time, and I wanna see how you deal with a moving target. This is perfect right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good, plain, old-fashioned fun. Speeds. On, off, and don't push your luck. Why are you getting all ornery? That ain't right. <laughs> this is perfect right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good, plain, old-fashioned fun. Just for the hell of it. This is perfect right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good, plain, old fashioned fun.
That's it, beauty. And again, Trevor. Nice. Go on, one more, just for the hell of it. I never knew you were such an agitator, Cletus. All these damn tourists coming out here to gop at rednecks. Give them what they want, I say. That ain't the weapon for this. This is perfect right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good plain old fashioned fun. than molasses on a cold day. That's it, beauty. In again, Trevor. This is perfect right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good plain old fashioned fun. Shy. Tires don't feel no pain. Nice! Go on, one more, just for the hell of it. You'd do a lot better with a sniper rifle. Shit for brains. This is perfect right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good plain old fashioned fun. Come on, gotta show them sometimes you ain't a slave to the system. I'm pro gun control. A steady hand on the trigger. That's it, beauty. And again, Trevor. Nice! Go on, one more, just for the hell of it. That was some damn fine shooting, Trevor. Right, let's change it up. Come on, follow me. Just two fellers killing time in small town America. Don't get much better than this, does it? The two most popular guys in town. Am I glad I ran into you? Ain't nowhere near this fun being antisocial on your own. Whatever cranks your tractor, I say. What's up next on the hillbilly anarchist agenda? Ever shot anything with a face? Actually, let me ask it again. Ever shot anything with a face on four legs? Now, Cletus, it's important you realize I'm a man plagued by vicious rumors. Fine. Let's head for the roof. I seen some coyotes hanging around down by the road. Reckon it would be real neighborly of us to get rid of a couple. And we are nothing if not... Neighborly. Should start calling you Mal Coordinator. We'll get a better shot from up here. We'll get a better shot from up here. All right, I see him. Looks like we got two packs of coyotes down there. Take a few of them out and the rest should scatter. You're even saving on bullets now. What? That should do it. Nicely. More chance of landing a cargo plane. I reckon you should tag along next time I go hunting out at Polito Bay. I'll show you how to bag an elk. Eh, uh, why not? All right, gotta go. I'll send you a text when I'm about.
Don't aim at something you ain't prepared to kill.